Hello, today I'm going to show you how to check out a Git repository onto your iPhone using BugBranch. To get started, first you need to add a source in BugBranch. To do that, go to the main menu, click Sources, and then click the plus button to add a source. Since I'm going to be checking out a Git repository, I click Git as the source type. Then you tell it a little bit of information about the repository that you're checking out. One of my favorite projects is the Flask framework for Python, so I'm going to check out Flask. The repository lives on GitHub, so I'm going to type in the URL on GitHub, Mitsuhiko, and it's flask.git. The username and password here are optional since it's a public repository. BugBranch has full support for private repositories, so you can enter a user and password, username and password if necessary. You click Save and BugBranch will add it as a source, then immediately start cloning all of the commits right there on your iPhone. When it's done, you see a full list of the commits, and you can browse what happened on a particular commit. See the commit message, who did it, when it happened, which branch, and all the files that were committed and changed. So for instance, I want to see the commit files here. Um, and I want to look at a particular Python file like the conf.py here. I click it. You can see the full source code of the file. It's completely syntax highlighted. And if you have an iPad, BugBranch also works there. And you can see a larger screen full of code. And you can also see a diff view of the code that was committed right here. And that's it. Now you have a GitHub repository on your iPhone and you can keep track of all the changes to the code right there on your phone.